here it is. So we have QTAR decks that we are going to introduce in next few live streams during the full moon reading. This is just the first full moon reading as well. We are going to have uh, a full moon reading um, in the next 24 hours. Uh, I guess two more times for you in different time because it's different time zone and because uh, my YouTube fans are literally from starting from far from far east towards the west coast in US. So literally uh, right now when there is a good night in Asia and good evening Europe and uh, good morning in US. Uh, I'm going to prepare a few different live streams, I promise, uh, with the tarot readings and warnings, daily warnings, of course, uh, in each live stream on the start. Um, today, we are going as well to touch a little bit of election in the US. You asked me this to do this reading about the election in the US. And um, of course, on the start, I'm going to pull up for you the card of the day the wisdom of today and again guys if you didn't join me before happy new year to all of you the blessings of the 2024 and no suffering of any living being any human being any living being pardon uh, on the planet earth um in this year amen we start with this pray no more wars in whatever is a war zone, no more suffering of any living being, wherever they are suffering, to not to feel the pain and to stop their suffering. Divine energy, please join and help all these people that they are suffering and they are in need. As well, open the selfish people, open their hearts to support the people who are in need, whatever there is uh, the religious blockage, whatever is their uh, race, religious blockage, removing any kind of a blockage in between people, or well, if there is a gender issue, remove the gender issue, any kind of taboo and prejudges, uh, because at the end we are all the one. And it's amazing because somehow in the background, like I see all, all over my head here, correct? like its reflection from the window because behind the computer, a little behind the screen is a uh, um, window and there is literally me watching right now and collecting the energy of this amazing woman. Again, guys, welcome to the season of Aquarius and this is the first one, first one entering the first full moon uh, literally happening uh, in, in this in this season again uh, we are going to open i'm just looking that full moon right now and we are going to open the first card let's see what is the card of today again here it's just 24 uh 24 of january again um don't forget guys that tomorrow 25th again depending where you are uh it will be the full moon so don't forget next 24 hours to do that still not late even the day after to do the full moon ritual and again reminder full moon ritual not to put the wish list what you want but the wish of deleting the things that you don't want put on the list all the blockages that you have and burning all over the candle and that takes me back to Lighting the candles for our praise of today. Again, stop the war in any war zone as well. Stop the suffering of any human being, any living being on the planet Earth. Any living being that was made of divine energy doesn't deserve to suffer. Amen. As well, people who are full of hate and spreading the disinformation uh, to be to be any kind of disinformation and people who are spreading the hate to literally um, be dissolved any kind of blockage of the media as well and the people who are spreading the uh, who are the who are promoting the war and the hate to be stopped um, 
again guys in my service um, i was a humanitarian i'm going to repeat and you can check in description about me if you didn't subscribe again check if you are still subscriber welcome the returning one and the new one and don't forget to put the alarm bell next to my name it's a large bell. Check in description about me. Yes, when you go and stroll uh, or looking my profile, correct, you will see uh, starting behind my that round thing with my face. Uh, then looking on your screen on your telephone, it will be on the next side. It will be on the right side. It will be literally description about the channel, and you can click on description more to check all my links and join. Please join the rest of my social media. Here it is. I'm putting a little, I'm pressing the space a little bit. One second. A little bit clumsy today with my copper, little copper jar from the holy place. Uh, bring the one from India. And once again, let me just put a little bit more of this. It's still there, yes. So, like we repeat, for the full moon, you need one candle, a piece of paper. On the paper, write all the blockages, everything that you don't want anymore in your life, and delete it, burn it all over the all over the candle. You have asked a few times in mails or comments what to do with the rest of the paper, the ashes from that paper with that black list that you are deleting during the full moon. You just better than you know the last option is to put it in the toilet and just flash it never leave it in the house garbage never 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 just as well the same candle if you leave it leave it just outdoor be be focused not to leave it on the wind and just observe it while it's deleted melted that candle not to provoke some fire of course as well um Again, if it's too windy and you're in a hot area, again, not everywhere the winter like here, uh, don't forget to do it inside of the room, not to make any kind of accident. And as well, guys, observe the candle, don't leave it, um, don't leave the candle in your house while you're sleeping or uh, while it's not attending the, while you are away from home. Uh, so you are welcome to check out the, the list my playlist rituals where you will see a different bunch of money attraction love attraction different kind of rituals that you can do but deserve for the new moon but now we are talking about full moon what is resolving the full moon is here to resolve our uh, dilemmas our dark side and uh, meanwhile we are going uh, to talk what's the point and what is reflection what is the warning with this full moon and into the leo happening 25th of january 2024 literally what will be the the message of a day and now it's a day before full moon 24 here uh, so give me the card of wisdom of self-healing card for 24 of january forgive yourself and observing it's crucial here to observe whatever is the negative thought pattern in your mind these days. Look at these two cards I'm picking up. Observe and forgive yourself. Whatever, observe yourself and try to focus on the positive side. Whatever is negative burning on the blacklist over the candle during the full moon, but do not be attached with repeating the things, the negative thoughts. Um, as well, don't be too hard. Again, importance on the bottom is popping out the last card, amazing card that I have literally used it in um, the start in our pray that we are all the part of divine energy and spreading the hate or spreading uh, whatever is your cause, spreading the hate uh, because whatever is a background intolerance religious race whatever it is literally doesn't help you political hate as well doesn't help you at this moment at the end we are all the one and we belong to divine we are coming from divine energy and surrendering to that divine energy it's crucial uh, at this point it's amazing energy and um how dramatical is this full moon that is literally giving us uh, giving them this uh 
outbreak of I'm powerless, but on the other side, should I surrender? That's our crossroad with this thought. I'm just going to literally, if you can see, again, apology. Maybe I should put it here, but I don't think you can see it. It's far away, but let's just leave it behind. Can I, can I put it here? I think it's too far away from you, but again, I'm just going to focus it again so you can read it, surrendering to divine energy. And look at the beautiful task of 24th January for you guys. Identifying one fear, one negative thought uh, in your mind next 24 hours and unconditionally surrendering into the hands of divine. The prey can truly change entire life. Trust the protest. Trust the protest. Today I heard of one of the astrolog colleagues in a early morning uh, live stream from the East Coast. Literally, I heard that trust. It's important of us to trust whatever is confusion, feeling powerless, feeling dark because of so many war and so many formations, um, as well as so many blockages of uh, real media news the real injustice that's happening in many war zones from the other side, the news that you don't even hear. And we are confused and um, bombing with so much dark information in previous year. It really took us to one side, to one, uh, one corner where we feel some of you are writing that you feel um, powerless and you feel hopeless but never lose the hope and never lose the prey because praying uh, uh, at this wherever you are at this um, uh, such a powerless moment in a history of civilization I'm ashamed to call it even civilization what is happening every day in front of the medias I mean we are now in the third world war where we have a lot of media at the end of the day um, we have had some kind of presentation of the suffering of the people more than we had in the previous uh, global wars uh, thanks to the technology but it's literally uh, giving us as well um, a tool to think and continue and push up idea of praying to stop that darkness that is prevailing with all this war profiteering, promoting wars in so many wars on and new one. So, um, again, I'm going to pull up for 12 zodiac signs. Welcome as well, guys. While we are in the live stream, you can pre order. You're reading as well. There is a free pendulum, of course. There is always a free pendulum, and I'm choosing a few different types of the pendulum, following my energy, and as well um, following energy of your question. Um, that will be the free of charge pendulum answer, yes or no. Of course, uh, there is as well mini chat is just 8.88 by people only sale. As well, if you want to send a donation, welcome to PayPal. As well, you can write your comments in under any of the videos, not necessarily in the live stream, because sometimes the live streams are shadow banned, like literally right now. And guys, again, um, during any live stream, we have a pendulum answer yes or no. So you just have to write in a form yes or no uh, to get to that free answer with the pendulum the rest is mini chat with the free cards is on sale 8.88 and the full answer is 25 or 24 today is 24 because we have that date the year 24 and 24 of january so um we are referring uh to this amazing number of today so let's see I'm going to start up and pull out the card starting from Aries. What are the messages of the what are the messages for Aries? Let me just type.
Give me a few messages for Aries. The full moon in January, what is bringing to Aries? Wow, great, 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 great. Look at I just heard great, 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 great. For some of you, re returning back to the ideas uh, of the restarting the serious decision if it's a love life or literally um, um, giving a second chance to some project and becoming literally um, successful into this. Um, let me just see. Thanks to the third party. If it was a love that was a third party, there is a chance of you reevaluating um, and thinking over of the third party situation that you left behind. Suddenly, uh, the rational Aries would never do, but this suddenly uh, moment of feeling open in heart, unconditional love, and connected that person. Uh, it, this is like a situation where somebody was so obsessive with the cash, but now I have overcome my financial blockages. I'm, I can offer you something um, as well. It could be the age difference. But again, this is would take us to a full answer with the love reading, but it's just a little bit of everything. Again, uh, like I said, if there was a work, if we talk about the work, usually on Tuesday and um, Wednesday we have the work questions. But again, this is just the first live stream uh, for this month. And, and literally, guys, I'm just going to, to uh, collect a little bit of everything. Love was first answer and then in the form of the work. Whatever was your hard work in the past time, literally, it's it could be crucial if you return back to the, the boss if you uh, give a second chance a uh, small details referring to again and give it the chance to some project that was there in the drawer or some past idea or offering it to another source um, another sponsor or find or trying to have an, another type another field of job uh, it's interesting there is importance of being creative finding a new solution for something that was your hard work in the past but uh, promoting somewhere else on in a different or at least if it's on the same place in a different manners definitely a great period because uh, with the wheel of fortune you are getting the luck here is uh, good luck to you again you can pre-order your you can pre-order your uh, reading in on, is on sale by PayPal donation as well. Thank you for any kind of donation. There are the in description about me. There are the links for other uh, type of donations, not just PayPal. Uh, buy me the coffee, etc. Uh, let's see a little bit of energy of Taurus for today. Full moon energy of Taurus. Give me some warnings for Taurus. For full moon again, it's popping out the first card. Wow. Uh, there are two, I said the wow, because there are two major kind of cards here. And again, your energy towards here. Um, definitely, since whatever was faked in the past time or you were feeling suppressed or blocked, whatever was in a fake foundation, you could have uh, now a new perspective, new information. Look at this is a card of information being exposed in the fake things, uh, informations. Uh, or something that was on a fake base. If it's a love, uh, you could recognize that everything is fake exposing. If it's a fake that you thought is a true love, it's going to be exposed as well. Uh, for some of you, if there is one person, if there is a love situation and one person uh, is seriously interested in relation where another is faking, everything that is on a fake foundation where you both don't have a same interest it will really have a failure and that's how it's showing up here um again for the love decision if one person is pushing being over dramatic in the relationship is it a fake friend or a fake lover literally not enough serious not involved like you are literally you could be undecided should you literally um um release this person on the other side there is that power locate for you uh, to release, resolve the connections of the past love trauma if you're single and embrace the new love. How I see it, because no more judgment, you need to release the judgment about that everybody's fake, like you have a bad experience in the past time and get involved into the new love, love cycle because definitely we are entering a period where the Taurus will have that power to, with the Empress card and Queen of Pentacles, 
you're getting in a cycle where you will be open um, in the season of Aquarius. You will be open for attracting the real love this time. So just be open for these opportunities and Taurus do not reject the opportunities uh, to go out, invitation. Just don't be isolated like you were in a previous period. Let me just see like this. Taurus. Again, for the Taurus, for the sum of you that you were thinking of the work, not of the love. This is idea where you had to realize uh, that you're getting the new informations about something that you were waiting for a long period. Is that the uh, was based on a fake promises, uh, or if you were unemployed waiting for a job, it's turning up the new information that's going literally to remove uh, you from being focused on that type of job. And it's advice to ask uh, the help of the universe literally to guide you towards the new real position where you will be safe and you will find as well your full mission um, uh, and full purpose in the new position or a new job uh, or a new company. Let's see Gemini. Gemini, Gemini, two warnings for Gemini. Wow. Again, information, expose whatever was stressful in the previous period. It's time literally um, to Gemini to finish the cycle. Whatever was stressful for you, there is a knowledge, there is a bravery being now realistic. And finishing the cycle, whatever is stressful. Is that something from the past that you were not brave in the past and to remove it? Now you are wherever you were returning on and off for a job or for a love. Little, it's not working this way. This time you had to be brave to finish the cycle that they are toxic in your life. Um, and universe is going to give you a blessing if you're brave enough to finish and be honest towards yourself and others. <clears throat> Let's see. Cancer. for you guys cancer for your reading for cancer for your warning for cancer wow I'm stopping here interesting I just heard like go and check as well the Gemini reading because here it is. If whatever was your dilemma in the past time, look at you had the dilemma. Uh, should you finish and walk away from certain situation? You were undecided. It could be that manipulation of your boss, uh, egocentric person, friend, or even uh, your lover or serious relationship. Or could be um, literally um, recognizing uh, that it's it's gone. The trust. Is gone and you're realistic now you want to finish the cycle it's like that it's a sport where you are going to finish the the cycle with the people that they were doing anything uh, for their own selfish reason and being not putting you as a priority or being open with so many others uh, and as well if it's a, a connection it's not a love this is just a physical connection where the other person is polygamic and not focus only on you. That is really clarity here that um, you need to make walk in um, shoes of truth and be realistic about this relationship or position if it's about work and time to walk away from the situation that no longer serves you. Some of you, you could be uh, annoyed with the selfishness of others with who you have a serious connection, work, home, um, as well uh, for some of you, again, advice, if you have some confusion about life decision, life, it could be love of work, friends, literally, uh, it's elderly, elderly figure in your life. Is it a father, a grandfather? Is it experienced person, expert could give you a great advice 
Uh, so cancer, don't be ashamed to ask for advice as well. If you have that dilemma, like you have on the start with the card of the two pentacle, uh, should you walk away or not? Some of you, you're getting literally protection of that older figure from a work or from a family uh, from, or from experience uh, older a friend. Uh, while you need somebody as a shelter walking away from some toxic relationship. So, good luck to you. Be protected. Uh, let's see, Leo. Again, guys, don't forget to hit the like, subscribe if you want a private reading here on Discount in the live stream. As well, subscribe to the alarm bell to see the next live stream. As well, you can buy PayPal, write me in the PayPal mailbox and send a donation for uh, your reading. If it's a private reading, it's a full price in the live stream. It's on discount like today as well. Let's see. We're doing the Leo. Leo full moon messages for Leos. Stopping here. It's showing up reverse moon and devil energy. Uh, and there is that exposing Leo. You're in a full power again. This is your card as well, son, that you can expose all these secret lies, uh, to toxic connection, could be some kind of addiction or uh, with the people around you or exposing somebody else having some kind of addiction. It could be your partner having some kind of addiction and you, you are nagging about Um Definitely, you are now in such a um, such a state with the full moon in Leo, where you have dramatically to finish some cycle uh, with people with who you work or have a serious contract or even live. Um, you are definitely going to expose their secrets, um, and universe is pushing you to make some radical decision about something that was not working for a while or was secretive from you. Let's see where we go. 29. Full moon warnings for where it goes. Wow, some of you are thinking over the pregnancy or becoming a parent. It's really a time for right decision. Is it the right moment for you Virgo, to become a parent? Uh, as well, somebody is preparing, planning to be a parent. Some of you Virgo, you have intention, some strategy about making decision towards the Taurus as well. This is a card of Taurus as well. If it's not about pregnancy, it could be an older female figure in your life or uh, could be a person in a Taurus sign as well. Just one pick. Again, this is a general reading, just one of the stories, possible warnings about Virgos. Wow. You can manifest this. This is your card as well. Here you're in the power to manifest for some of you becoming a parent or manifest that relation with a certain person that's again it could be a person that is having the earth energy whatever was before some intention that it was just physical now it's right moment to have a serious decision i see that you both have a pure chemistry look at queen and king of wands but here it is it's a time for making a serious decision recognizing a person as uh, as um as a person that is your soulmate, that uh, uh, you can manifest some serious decision. Uh, for some of you, it's time to manifest um, a new friendship that will be literally um, um, serious friendship uh, in future. Friendship, love, um, literally um, just a general, uh, general reading again. Don't forget to hit subscribe and put the alarm bell to join the daily and 
personal readings to see example of the law of finance uh, and spiritual readings. Um, again, like I said, it's time for the birth of Virgos and definitely time and so obvious. Whatever you were suppressing, if there was some rebirth of emotions, if there were secret emotions uh, that you left on a cold, it's time to literally start something serious. Um, good luck, Virgos. Let's see. Libra. 32 minutes. Full moon. Warning for Libra. Wow, undecided. Wow, passionate about. Wow, passionate about certain person. Wow, could be that. Wow, overthinking. Should I stay with that serious offer or should I follow my passion and thinking over restarting the connection where in the past time you have rejected somebody? Giving a chance is crucial here uh, with somebody that in the past time was just a flirt, nothing serious, maybe someone I stand or just a physical now it's time for a serious decision and revisiting certain people in the past and that you didn't get into some serious level of relationship or maybe you just met but you have a missed opportunity to uh, have anything with them Libra think about this it's a good period for restarting the connections that they were somehow left on the cold I must say left left on the cold and that's confirming with this card as well. Uh, finishing whatever was on hold, it's time to release these blockages uh, and um, get into the real life. Uh, let's see. Scorpio. 33. This was very short for Libra, so obvious. Scorpio, full moon warning for Scorpio. Wow. Wow, look at this, Scorpio. Wow, crossroads. Should I walk away or not? I can't remember the reading of, of Cancer, again, another water sign, that where they need support of a friend or advice of an expert if they want to walk away. This is a crossroad as well of Scorpio to walk away from a certain unserious decision. I see two cards walking away at uh, for some of you, a person was suppressing emotion too long to uh, have that um, evaluation of the relationship. Uh, uh, it's right moment now to express it. But whatever you are going to express, it will finish like a breakup these days, Scorpio. Just a warning. Let's see. Sagittarius. Four. Full moon warning for Sagittarius. Wow. Some of you, Sagittarius, you're literally pointing from divine energy to manifest your personal rebirth. Look at these amazing cards. Okay, the order was like this. I have to rebirth. Yes, I can manifest rebirth. It's so clear. Whatever was suppressed and whatever I was undecided in the past time, if I left on a cold sort of relationship, somebody that I met in the past, it's a moment of expression where you find serious somebody from the past that you left on a cold. Like universe is giving you Sagittarius the seriosity to think over what did you do wrongly about people in the past and friends, possible partner that you run serious like this time universe is not giving you that childish decision uh, no more that time for a place Sagittarius it's a moment of a serious decision in your life uh, but with the somebody from the past for some of you just as well if it's not a certain person from the past uh, if you are just going to tell me I'm totally single it could be just in a general reading just idea give me more give me more for singles yes time for momentous literally expressing something no more bitterness not more no more 
black heart and traumas from the past time. Literally, be apologetic towards yourself. Don't be over strict. Remember the cards where we said forgive yourself in that uh, a startup of the of the day card of the self healing of today. Oh, amazing, the card looks like my nails, isn't it? Give it a chance to your own happiness. It's important, but with a serious decision. If you have, like I said, if there is some person that you overthink to revisit, it could be a person that you rejected, it's time to revisit. And as well, thinking over a happy moment enjoyment in your life. That's a priority at this moment for you. Uh, let's see, Capri, Horns. Guys, my computer is left here. I don't see what I'm typing. Let's see. Capricorn, one is for full moon for Capricorn. For some of you, wow. Could be a master manipulation at work. <laughs> a right decision you're literally a magnet people could listen to you whatever is a decision around finance or work mm. you are still in the power to manifest your ideas you're literally going to keep the audience listening and following your decision if there are some idea that you were suppressing in the past time, time to work out, time to express it. Because this is your card, Capricorn. Express it, whatever was suppressed. Give it to the media. Work on your promotion. Be public or express the thing to your boss or at least uh, to a people that they could uh, have a final word and be powerful enough to help you. Uh, in realization, that idea. Let's see. Aquarius. 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 Full moon warnings for Aquarius. Wow. Interesting. Under this dramatical full moon, obviously for you, Aquarius, you're determined. With the king of swords literally representing you, uh, being um, walking in your statements, asking for the truth, don't be over dramatical during these full moon days and under the influence uh, as well. For some of you having decision to cut some ties, if the universe serving you, giving you the truth about some secrets uh, that they were happening behind your back that you were not aware, um, literally it could be in a love life or people that you trusted, somehow you feel a failure and behavior with the people that have a business contract with you or living under the same rooftop or company with you, literally. Just um, my advice, uh, Cool it and don't make a serious decision during the full moon a few days after. Um, let's say uh, it's reflecting the full moon next seven days. So knowing the truth, it's important, but not taking the, the spontaneous rush decision uh, because of the bad news. It's not a wise one. Let's see. Pisces, the last one. Here it is. I'm going to attach to the description the time frame. So the last one is Pisces.
to refresh the page. Pisces, the last one, warning for Pisces. Full moon warnings for Pisces. Wow. For some of you, there is the idea of having a second option in your life. Prosperous, if there is idea about having a section, second option, but you being a married and you want to the house as well. There is definitely idea, whatever you were holding on, there is idea um, of moving moving and being spontaneous, fighting no more rational idea, no more thinking over the finance and success, but being spontaneous. The Knight of Swords is giving me the idea of being spontaneous, not overthinking, and uh, opening this heart. Again, with this mirror down, it's literally representing somehow you, uh, Pisces, that mirror card here, that there is a knowledge inside of you what is going to please you, and that that there was on your mind, the second option in your life, uh, whatever is a field. This is definitely with these two cards could be emotional decision. Is it about being successful uh, and feeling healthy in your life, but definitely quitting for something. There is an action of divorcing or quitting from a job, anything that doesn't make you happy. And you're looking at this hour for a new option, new person, new job. Um, new location where to move for some of you relocating as well uh, it's important Pisces in next period could be relocating uh, with the office or relocating uh, to a new home with a new person as well or a new position in you at your job or with a new totally field of work amazing opportunity for Pisces you're going to surprise yourself with your decision definitely uh, in next few in next few days. Pisces after full moon. Uh, uh, your challenge on the bottom is that nine of swords. Don't be so stressful like you were a little coward before in the previous period for too long. Uh, that you were always obsessive about finance or a comfortable or, or comfortable lifestyle. I mean, in fact, being true in emotions and realistic about with who you live or with who you work. It's time for wake up and being brave, Pisces. Uh, the priority is to feel everything you no know, fake and to feel with a pure emotion. And definitely that uh, new option in your life will give you that opportunity. There are new door opening in your life uh, and use that opportunity. Be brave like Alisa in Wonderland. And go and check what is um, literally from other side of the mirror. What you were definitely, you were reflecting for a while, but you didn't want, you were not brave enough to walk from other side of the window or while other side of that mirror uh, and um, just stepping out of your comfortable zone is crucial for your personal joy and success vices at this hour. So, voila, guys. Um, this was... Uh, general warnings for 12 zodiac signs and the start first 15 minutes about full moon ritual and general collective energy of 24 of January. Again, guys, we are going to restart the live stream later on. Uh, next 24 hours, we have a few more live streams, so you can join with your PayPal donation to be first on the list to get an answer on uh, discount. Um, again, you have asked me, I'm going to do this all in one. You have asked me to do a little story about um, Nikki Haley. Uh, that was supposed to be in another live stream immediately after this, but uh, I'm going to continue here. I'm just going to attach the time frame for uh, this reading. Uh, so it's interesting because somehow I... Did somebody send me a question that Nikki Haley is having a birthday? Is literally uh, somehow on um, um, on the border between Capricorn and startup of Aquarius. And uh, interesting again, and very it's not interesting. It's weird because why why she is um, definitely not so old person um, uh, having not a time, there is no a real time of her birth. Um, that's a weird a little bit, I think. It's not weird, you have asked me, you told me it's a weird one to check it. I'm just going to ask, while there is no time frame for 
Nikki Haley Bird. Bird time. Is this manipulation? Yes. Definitely this is on hold. It's a blockage. It's on information, as you see. It's a, This is definitely my card of the... This is my card of blockages of information on purpose. Uh, but will we find a real birth time and birth details of Nikki Haley? People will be, there will be always a mystery about her uh, details of her birth, uh, birth, play, birth, birth time. Um, uh, it's literally like she's hiding because this person is very fake. It's as well, she's she was told from her teamwork who is organizing this election campaign not to expose all these details and to put the wrong, in fact, the fake informations are there. They are because of the judgment of the surrounding. What was happening in the past time about her being cheating? Look at her cheating. Uh, there is definitely a judgment of... Um, um, and people who are advising her in her election cycle, uh, literally, um, they advise her to hide um, her um, astrological uh, infos. Again, nonsense, because whatever you start on the fake foundations is not going to work. Like, remember uh, Bill and Hillary Clinton, everything was from the start fake. On the start of their marriage, just comparing, it's interesting because as well I'm getting the spirit confirmation because I'm getting all the blue spots now. Wow, literally, wow. And I've literally um, had that comparison. How fake was Hillary with the bill? How fake is now um, uh, Nikki Haley in her marriage? Um, and whatever is on fake foundation, like I started the sentence, uh, with support, confirmation, the spirit, uh, whatever was... Uh, it was fake in the Clinton story is fake as well in this story and what is on fake foundation marriage being in a cycle of election but not walking in a shoes of uh, these moral values that they represent and the future president um, it's fake 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 um, they're trying her teamwork is trying with this three of pentacle and and nine of wands uh, to break and to represent her in a fake, um, um, not real Nikki Haley um, um, story. Um, but the, whatever is strategic, it's fake. And literally people are going to literally know the truth. This judge here, it's literally, as you see, sorry, with a little different hand. Uh, literally, whatever is secret, people are going to find out. Um, and like I said, um, it's not working what is on a fake foundation. Um, again, is Nikki Haley having them? Nikki Haley will have a divorce? No. Even if it's totally unfair, but this is their story is over definitely uh, somehow deep there in their bedroom their home at the end of the day but by this exposing but they're postponing it. again as you see they're patient postponing the um uh, uh there is the codependence and trying to manifest this for a purpose of politics and her Husband is having, we don't see her as a queen of cup. We see that unconditional love from her stupid husband, definitely. Um, when you have a wife that is literally in politics and plus cheating on you, like, do you really need a double W H O R E to be called your wife? Like, who is this guy? Like, nonsense. This guy is definitely feeling embarrassed. Now he's trapped because they started to roll an election. He cannot move out. But as you see here, I saw the death card and the uh, nine of pentacles as a synonym of it's over this relationship. Faking is over. And he's this guy at the end of the nurse, as you see. King of Cup and... Um, 
king of top and uh, ten of swords, a uh, guy who is ready to liberate himself from all, all this faking and nonsense, because somehow this public humiliation uh, is a last last drop in that a cup of injustice that was happening. Uh, and he's really, he's done with her BS. Uh, but again, will Nikki Haley He can, she cannot win. Will she win in election? No, because all this exposing the evidence, wow, whatever they were hiding, it's coming out and it's not working. Her addiction with whatever was her addiction, like there is so much lies that the media are exposing and it's not working like that. Like, guys, we can have a need is it politician who is having that material greediness? Is it a new hobby that they think it will work out as successful um, a project, turn to be uh, famous and everybody's dream? This is not working. In her case, it's not working uh, because she's exposed before election and um, it's so much dirty laundry that people are not into her anymore. I'm talking about people who are going to vote. Mm. Was there a confirmation that there was a third? First of all, from my old reading about Trump, if you remember last year, I was all the time repeating there will be some third party, not, not, not the Florida guy. Uh, not uh, there will be the third option that will be his own concurrence, the only enemy, and that's now popping out last few months. Nikki Haley, the new story here popping out uh, into the election uh, as at the moment worst enemy of Trump uh, is Nikki Haley, but uh, not the Biden, and, he, uh, and uh, that is confirming my old reading with Trump will have some third option that will show up at the last moment. So go check up the old reading of about Trump uh, from the last year. All the time was repeating there is a third party that will show up. Um, but as well, um, with all this information, it's literally this person, with all this information, the person has uh, uh, a concurrence to Trump um is going to fail will there be another option again for the next week for political team readings we are going to talk more i have so much obvious exposing uh this is a judgment card where through the media it's exposing public humiliation is crucial and all these lies will not work in the case of Nikki Haley. Uh, so definitely she won't have a success as uh, people were thinking before they got this information from uh, her uh, past life. It's not past life, it's her it's her life, and people don't change. Bill Clinton or Hillary Clinton, nobody changing in life. They can do the different style. They can change the political party. They can change the style of the physical appearance. But definitely nobody with their moral values ever change. From childhood to the adult uh, and older age, we don't change. We are born with the spirit and our moral values are inside of us. And do not trust the people who are fake in front of you. Do not give a vote to a people who are fake and who are going to push you, specifically with this Nikki Haley story that she's having so much uh, uh, energy of that fighting mode. It's really, really a person that you don't want. Uh, live the private life and lies. Uh, live all that BS uh, with um, 
private life information, but just do you want, just I'm asking, do you want really in the middle of the World War III to have a person that is having so much um, that conflict inside of her and so much that Mars energy uh, that's literally calling for just supporting the more war profiters and um, literally promoting uh, war to continue. Uh, definitely not a safe option for anybody uh, to have these kind of people. Just think of the people who were not in the past uh, promoting the war. Just think of the people and uh, presidents uh, like only a few good people that they were not promoting the war. Uh, and um, I'm not going to be influencer about your political decision. Of course, everybody has own opinion. But just, guys, again, at the end of every of the live stream, uh, I just uh, ask you uh, to pray for war to stop. And there is so many war zones, more than 22 war zones. That was last year. Probably right now with this Yemen and other war zones. Uh, it's popping out more, the number is going higher. But so many war zones that we need to pray for not suffering of the people that are in the middle of the war zone, all the, all the living beings uh, on the planet Earth, that they are suffering, is it from the food chain industry? Uh, is it from the violence uh, and um, organs trafficking, is it from the people who are predators and so many missing people on the planet Earth? Um, and again, uh, let's pray that there is no soul that they're suffering on the planet Earth and let's pray this any kind of the negative dark energy and uh, uh, war profiteering to be stopped and the rest of the living beings to be uh, protected from that darkness. Amen. Again, guys, uh, if you are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe. Check the description about me, my life, my humanitarian purpose in my life. Uh, and as well, thank you in advance for any kind of PayPal donation as well. Buy me the coffee and coffee. A uh, few other options that you have for that donation uh, as a link. Uh, but I prefer PayPal, I must say. And uh, don't forget to subscribe and put a alarm bell for the next live stream where you can have a, where you can have a free answer by Pendulum. That's my giveaway as well. Uh, bringing your friend, you can get one extra answer mini chat for free as well. Uh, literally, guys, uh, there is uh, in next few days where we still have we still have energy of the full moon. Uh, we are going to have this PayPal sale. Uh, readings in the live stream. If you pre-book it uh, on PayPal link, of course, and leave your question there, you will be the first on the list in next live stream as well for that reading. Uh, because in the live stream is on total discount. Instead of 25, mini chat is just 8.88. And instead of a full answer, 150 is just 24 in the live stream this week. This is all. And God bless you guys. And Pray this war to stop. Amen.